Welcome back everybody to Icarus. I'm an old guy gaming and I'm going to give you an update on where we are uh, with our current prospects. So I've spent uh, quite a bit of time off camera um, doing stuff, you know, grinding, hunting, mining, lumberjacking, etc, etc. And um, so I just wanted to bring you back for an update right now because we are ready now to get started with our build and I'm getting sick and tired of living in this damn cave um, sick literally because I've hit, got pneumonia several times I did make the tonic but still it's a pain in the butt so um, let's uh, let's get started with this so I have a little more meat I want to put in here and we got some pumpkins I've, I haven't bothered trying to make good food I just make whatever uh, for now until we can get set up in the house uh, all right so basically all of my stuff is back here as you can see, I got an anvil. I've got a an herbal uh, herbalism station. What is this called? Herbalism bench. Yeah, uh, oxide dissolver, crafting bench. I got two furnaces. I got one in here and an, and another one in a cave nearby that has been processing more iron and copper. Um, and yeah, that's pretty much it. I've already mined all the iron and copper out of this cave. Everything else that's left in here are high level ores, which I can't do till I get steel. Uh, I have made steel bloom in here, but I'm not going to start making actual steel until we get into the house so our main focus right now is going to be that all right so uh, as you can see i've got a full bench here and so what we're going to do is we're going to start off uh, by making some foundations we can make a total of 27 we're not going to need that many well i don't think we're going to need that many um, why don't we start off with um I'm going to make, um, I think I'm going to make a three by four. I think that's going to be my standard size for our, you know, just our, our quick houses. Um, like I said, I'm not going to build anything elaborate, uh, at least not for now. Maybe when we do another real long prospect later on, uh, we'll play around with that again with some, you know, with some of the, the refined wood that we can now make. Uh, but for now, let's, uh, let's just start off with 20. Well, that might even be too many. I got it because we're going to build a bridge. But if we're going to do a 3x4, we're going to need 12 foundations. And then probably one on the opposite shore. Maybe two. So let's make 14 foundations. And then we're also going to... I'm going to need to leave a spot for that. Um, we're also going to need to make uh, some stone floors because we're going to make a bridge. And I don't know how many of those we're going to need. Probably six-ish. But we're going to also need these for other things, too. So let's make, say, maybe 10 of those. We'll get those going. And then um, we're going to need walls, of course. So we're going to need... Um, let's see, again, if we're doing 3 by 4 we're going to need uh, 6 and 8. So we're going to need 12 walls for the first floor. But we're going to make... Uh, we're going to do a, a you know, two-level place, so we're going to need about 24 of these then. Can we make that many? Uh, doesn't look like it. Okay. So, let's just start then with uh, these foundations here. Let me get that in there. And the... Uh, Oh, and the, yeah, and the ceilings. I was going to say, wait a minute, what happened to the ceilings? We don't need to carry this around, uh, this bone scythe for now, so we can put that in here. Uh, what do we got going on? A storm with lightning. Ah, doggone it. Perfect timing. Okay, well, um, I will meet you guys over at the build site when the damn storm is over. All right, guys, we are back and uh, ready to get started with our build here. Uh, so what we're going to do is I set a fire pit down here and have some building pieces in. So let's grab the foundations first. And <clears throat> uh, what I want to do is I want to line these foundations up with that kind of cross piece, I guess, of, of the landing over there. Uh, but we do want to make sure, too, that the foundations are high enough to, you know, so the stone below is not clipping through. So let's... um use this kind of as the center and put it right maybe right about here I'm thinking now is that gonna be high enough so the stone doesn't clip through it looks like it is okay so I think we're going gonna be fine there 
Uh, this is going to be a 3x4, three too, by the way. Okay, so we got our 3x3, three three, and there is our 4. Good. Okay, now uh, we want to bridge across to here. So we're going to put a foundation there and a foundation there. Yeah, that lined up pretty good. And now we want to go grab some ceilings. And we'll put those in that slot. And we'll put these out until the SI doesn't let us go any further, which is probably going to be this one. Yeah, it's rumbling, so... Um, okay. Let's get that guy out of there, because he's going to attack us otherwise. Uh, Alright, so now, uh, what we're going to have to do underneath this guy is put, a, put some pillars. So let's grab... those and you know the cool thing about this island too is there's there's room to make a bigger um base if you wanted to i mean we could go back another one this way and we could go out that way and out this way a little more too uh but again you know it's not uh we're not i'm not planning on making this a really elaborate build it's going to be a functional build uh all right so let's drop down into the water here and um, we're going to grab these pillars, and we're going to put them on the corner there, there, and there. And then one here, if we can get it to go down. There we go. And that is touching, right? Yes, it is. Okay, perfect. So that should give us plenty of support to finish out the bridge. Another wolf. Did you eat my other wolves? Oh, you haven't. Figured he would have chowed down on them guys by now. Maybe he was getting ready to until he de detected us. Okay. Um, so now what we're going to do is we're going to go to there. And then we're going to put this last foundation in here. Not there. Here. And then we'll put a ramp. I got... Do I have ramps on me? No. Uh, I have ramps in the fire pit coming up to here. Yeah, that looks pretty good. Okay, cool. Looking good in the neighborhood. Um, I might... Eh, we don't really need to put a foundation on that corner. And these are already in the ground, so we're good, yeah. We are good to go. We might... You know what I might actually do, too, is build out from here and down to the water. So we have access to the water and access to the base from that side. But that's not a, a high priority right now. If we do that, what we might do is build like a little deck out here that we can also then, you know, put some farm plots and then maybe make the ramp go down this way. Yeah, I like that idea. Okay. So let's grab, can we grab the rest of this without getting too heavy? No. So let's put those back for the moment and put those back for the moment. I just want to go put this ramp piece in. I don't have all of the pieces I need to finish this build either, by the way, but... Enough to get us started for sure. Okay, so our original starter house in the last uh, prospect was a 3x3 three three if I remember right. So this gives us a 3x4. And I'm not necessarily at all going to make all the stuff we can make for this prospect. Um, so I want to see if a 3x4 is big enough. If it isn't, then you know we'll know and we can expand uh, later. All right, let's put this back in here for now. Uh, now we want to grab the walls. Let's get those in place next. So this one is obviously going to be a door. And we want it to go the other way. And we're going to need a door out to here as well if we're going to do my little uh, plan, which we are. Why won't that go the other way? I guess I'll have to just do it like that. Okay, so that's it for the doors. 
Uh, now let's do windows. So I'm going to put single windows here, 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 and here. And then we're going to do double windows here and here. And probably a single window here since that's um, a doorway. Everything else will be solid walls. Perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Okay. Um, now, let's go back to here. Put this in here. Grab these guys. And put the ceilings in place. Now, these... We want to make sure they're all going the right, the same direction. Uh, which I'm fine with this as long as they're all the same. Because otherwise we won't have symmetry. We'll have asymmetry. We don't want asymmetry, we want symmetry. Look at that. It's a beautiful thing. Now obviously we are going to have to take one of these back up uh, to make room for... Um, some stairs, or, um, we could go with ladders, but you know, ladders are going to be kind of a pain in the butt, I think. So, yeah, why don't we, in fact, we have some points that we could spend. We know how to make wood stairs, don't we? It would be nice to have stone stairs, and when it's all said and done, we're going to have more points than we know what to do with anyway. So, let's go to tier two, and let's learn... Uh, stone stairs. Uh, we should probably do reinforced windows as well. Uh, I don't know. Do we need ladders? Let's not do that for now. I am probably going to get all this interior wood stuff too. And, you know, a little bit of furniture, like some tables. The, how many points do I have? Three? Yeah, let's actually do these three here. There we go. Okay, and that spins those points. Beautiful. Um, now, I still think we might do wood stairs in here, though, just because it'll be inside the house. Uh, what does it take to make those? Crafting, uh, deployables, not deployable structures. Uh, we just need some fiber and some wood. All right, let's get that done now. Um, I actually have some wood. Oh, I got wood right here. Yeah, let's just grab all of this. That's from the, the remaining tree on the island. Grab a little bit of fiber. And let's make one of these. I'll put some railings and all that stuff up too. Just, just to make it... I mean, like, we're not doing anything elaborate, but we want it to look nice though. In spite of that, right? Uh, so let's go here... Uh, here and stairs and I'm just gonna put these in now I'm not gonna remove this ceiling piece until we have the upper part of the house built uh, but if I put that in now then I you know can build around it okay so here's the deal we're gonna uh, I'm gonna actually start moving into the base now because uh, I want to get out of that cave living in that cave sucks so I'm gonna do that and once I have all my stuff moved over to the bottom floor um, then I will farm up more materials to get the top floor done. What do we have left in here, by the way? We could... S yeah, we'll just wait on that. Because this stuff can stay in here. It's not going to get uh, ruined by the weather. I'm just going to put all of this in here, too. And then I'll bring you guys back uh, to finish out the build. Oh, that's kind of jank looking. What the hell? Um, will that set differently if there isn't a roof piece there. Oh my goodness. I've never I never noticed that. It's probably just wasn't noticeable on our other house. Um <coughs> there's n there's nothing I can do to change <coughs> change that huh I'm trying to see if I can get it to move back 
I guess I guess not. Oh, that sucks. Okay, well, I guess if that's the way it's got to be, that's the way it's got to be. Shut up, bear. Oh, and I put that in the wrong direction. Not that it matters, because that's not going to stay there permanently, but still, let's do it right for now. Okay. So, yeah, I'm going to cut the camera here, move all my stuff over uh, to the base here, farm up more materials to finish the base, and when I get to that point, I will bring you guys back. Uh, <clears throat> I was, I was, uh, crouched down here, semi AFK waiting for this damn storm to come up and the bear walked right up to the door, but then he turned around. Thank goodness he didn't see me. Holy Moses. We might have to put like a gate or something on the, our bridge here. Of course we, you know, we will have the doors in once I can get those in. Uh, but anyway, yeah, I wasn't actually planning on bringing you back right now, but I thought that was pretty interesting that that happened. It looks like we have some a little bleed wound going on, too. So, yeah, I'm still in the process of moving stuff over. So I will bring you guys back uh, when I finish that and get uh, some more stuff farmed up. All right, guys, we are back. I got everything moved in, and I got another batch of resources um, harvested up here to continue our build. So let me look in here. We've got uh, some walls here. And a couple of roof pieces. I'm going to put the sickle in here for now and the repair hammer as well. Excuse me. Um, okay, so we're going to need 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14 more walls. Uh, well, 10 more walls because we have the four there. So let's do 10 walls next. And then after that, we're going to need... Um, oh, you know what? Something just occurred to me. Now, we should only need, have to need four of the roof uh, of these guys. I think, yeah, I think we only need four of these. If we need more, we'll make more. Okay. So, let's grab the walls that we currently have, and we're going to... Pick this up. Um, I wonder if I should. Well, uh, we can make this work. It's it might be a little janky, but I think we can make it work. Okay, so this is going to be a single window here, and this is going to be a single window here. And then these will be double windows. Uh, and then we need to flip it around to that side and that side. And then everything else will be just solid walls. And we need four more pieces. There they are. And then let's also grab these ceiling pieces here. Oh, actually, we're going to need two more wall pieces as well. So put those there, that there, this there, that there. Okay. Now, you go there, and you go there. And then we need to turn this to this side. Oh, wait a minute. What am I doing? No, 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 no. Um, this side here. Yeah, we're going to need... What? I'm like all mixed up here. All right. Flip it to this way. There we go. Okay. <clears throat> so we're going to need two more normal walls and two more peaks. Okay, so two more normal walls and two more peaks. And then we're going to need... Oh, no, we're going to need a lot more. We're going to need peaks to go all the way across, too. Right, okay. 
Uh, four to be precise, I think. And that should finish out our build. Um, let me, let, let me sleep too, by the way. It's getting dark here. Okay, now it'll start to get lighter. Okay, so put that there, that there. And then we need to change you guys to... Oh, no, you know what? I, I screwed up. That's not what... We did not need these after all. Um... Yeah, I screwed that up. Okay. Well. Oh. Oh, oh. This side. This side's fine because it's on the ground, but this one is not. All right. So we're going to have to put uh, bring some pillars into play here then, too. So why don't we start with four on each corner and we'll see how that does. We'll put three of these down and, and recycle them. Or no, we don't have to do that. We can just do that from here. Uh, alt. Here, we'll just destroy those and we'll get some mats back. That we're going to need this one now. Okay, put that stuff back in there. All right, now... Um, oh, let's go do this from the corners here. And then we'll do the same thing up here. I need eight, not four. My math is just totally off today. Not that that's anything new. Oh my goodness. Let's get these uh, these two corners done first. All right, now is that going to let me put this up here or not? Yes, it is. We still might run some angled pieces, anyways, just for extra roof support. Uh, and if we do that, that means we're going to need another eight pillars. I think we should. Uh, we need some more iron nails now. All right, let's make another 50, or not 55 of these, which will make 50. Hopefully <clears throat> that'll be enough to finish this out without having to make a bunch more. Because we need to save our iron for other things. All right. So we needed another eight of these. We'll put these here. Like so. And then uh, we'll start putting our angled pieces in. Then we're going to need um, 16 roof pieces in. No, actually uh, 20 roof pieces in total. Because 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, and then the 4 across the top. So 20 pieces. We already have 3, so we need to make us uh, 17 more of those. If my math is correct. And it might not be. Okay. Uh, how many of these can we make? Two more. <laughs> okay, I'm going to have to go get some. Well, it's actually nails still that we need. All right. Well, son of a gun. Let's see how many more we can make with these nails, and then I'll have to make some more. So this is going to get us not quite half of what we need. Uh, we need 12 more of these, and they require 6 nails, so 12 times 6 is 120. Uh, right? No. 
That's 148. No, 72. Oh, I just need to give up on math today, you guys. Uh, so let's make 80 more of these. Or no, 8 more. Sorry, sorry. <laughs> Cancel. Oh, jeez. Eight, eight, we want 80 more, which means I needed to set it for eight more to make 80, not 800. All right, let's make a couple more of these. And then while those are cooking up, we can put our cross beams in. Uh, so we want to set them to here. Why is that showing red? Um, what? Oh, can we not put them along there? I guess not. Okay. Well, what if we just do beams coming up from the middle then? And then make this one a horizontal. And let's see if that's good enough to finish out the roof without having to put more in. Okay, so um, let's start putting these up. Okay, everybody happy so far? Oh, <laughs> we only needed... Yep, I miscounted those too. I thought we would we were gonna have to go up two. Oh goodness. Okay. This is you know how people have bad hair days? Well, this is a bad math day for me. That's just all there is to it. Bad math day. I'm in a hurry, I'm not paying attention. And stuff's happening. Now we could put another peak piece up there if we wanted to, but I don't know. I think we might just leave it the way it is. Okay, the last thing we have to put in are windows. Uh, we are going to use windows this time. And so we are going to need two, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. If I counted those correctly. And boy, don't bet any money on that. Okay, so that means we're going to need iron and more nails. So let's let's just make another hundred nails. Well, we have some, actually, that are left over. So, if we make 60 more of the nails, we should have enough to do all those windows. Okay, so what else do we need? Um, we're going to need iron ingots, so let's put some of those in here. Uh, I'm going to stick this roof piece in here. And what else did it say we needed? I think wood, right? Yeah. So let's grab a couple of stacks of wood out of here. Grab all of these. Wait. Oh, I didn't grab the nails. Didn't we put some nails in here already? We must not have. Whew, okay. Let's make 12 of those, and then we'll see how many uh, we have left after that. I'm going to keep uh, these in here for now, because later on, like I had talked about, we're going to make a, like a little ramp down to the water and... Kind of like a little uh, dock. That is the plan anyways. And of course we want to make it out of stone so it doesn't get destroyed from the storm. Okay, let's start putting windows in. Oh, I like that. These are on hinges instead of on the... Uh, 
you know, the little s s propped up stick thing, the doodle. Very nice. Okay, let's open them up. Says we're low on water. Uh, we will make a rain catcher thing, but for now, let's just drink lake water. You know, the bears are a little bit annoying. Content here, hearing them roaring, roaring over and over again. Um. Okay, so. Well, that's weird. <laughs> Look at that. Okay. Well, if that's the way it works, that's the way it works. All right. Let me count again how many more we need. So we're going to need two, four, five, six more up here. Okay. And we're short a few more nails, too. So let's just make 60 more. And then once uh, this is done, then we're you know pretty much done with the main build. Um, I will work on putting like a little stone deck out here and build a dock down to the water, uh, a ramp and a dock down to the water, and you know probably get a few crop plots going. That'll probably be the next thing I'll do. And then after that, um, uh, yeah. And then after that, I'm gonna start uh, advancing up the tech tree. Uh, with, you know, the higher level workstations. I might not bring you guys back until I have all of that complete, because, you know, you've seen it, you've seen me do it already in the, in the earlier videos, for one thing, but, um, you know, for you guys, you know, I don't want this to be a long, drawn out, doing the same, same old, same old thing over and over again. For me, I love it. Um, I just enjoy this game thoroughly, but on camera, you know, you guys aren't going to want to see me build a base every single time we do a drop and all that. So uh, I'll probably show less and less of that and get, you know, bring you back when we're ready to to really start working on the mission itself. Uh, that is the plan anyways. All right, guys. Well, I'm going to go ahead and how much time do we actually have on this mi uh, this mission, <laughs> this, this episode? Yeah, we're. I think I'm going to go ahead and wrap it up here because there isn't really anything else at this point to do um i'm gonna have to get some more iron mined in order to you know to build the little deck anyways um so i think we're gonna go ahead and let you guys go here and then the plan as of right now unless something crazy happens in between now and then is to bring you back once i am ready to actually resume the mission and i have all my equipment and all of that okay so guys thanks for watching hope you enjoyed the episode if you did please hit that like button and subscribe to the channel leave a comment and share out the video and we'll catch you in the next episode. Bye-bye.